All right, everybody. So today we're gonna to take a look at a Robson floor plan that we did for a client. We have our roof rack up top along with our Dometic electric awning. So push of a button on a remote and comes out and goes back in. Also has a 12 volt light for enjoying the evenings. This here is our drop down for either cooking in the summertime or just setting your drinks on. As we move in, we've got additional counter space here for cooking and prep. If you wanna cook with the doors open, we do have the roll off bug screen that comes down. So that comes down and then easily goes back up when you don't have to worry about the pesky bugs. Now, as you come inside here, we do have additional space that we've designed up here. This is typically stock what comes in a vehicle, but there's a lot of wasted space here. So that's why we've added an additional shelf. And this is great for uh, either clothing or jackets or throwing a hoodie in there, just things that need to be accessible from the driver's seat. Uh, as we take a peek right here, we've got our broad arrow windows. These are great because you have the blinds and the bug screen built in, but they also extend out awning style as opposed to a sliding style. So even when it's raining out, you can have these open and just put your bug screen down. So great, great window, very happy with them. Now we've got a dining setup here with swivel on this seat and on the passenger seat as well. And this is hooked on to a Lippert arm that you can find in our store with bamboo top. We've got bamboo countertop throughout the van. Now, as we bring this over, we've worked with a company called Limitless Van and they've designed a swivel seat on the bottom here that allows you to turn your seat when you don't need to drive. A 90 degree so that you can enjoy seating this way when you're just enjoying food or cooking or doing whatever you want. Now as we take a look at our dinette, we have the Rivati sink here. Great little setup. We also have an induction cooktop. Now underneath here, we've got access to um, additional storage, but also your gray water system that is super simple to, to dump and, and take care of once it's full. We've got additional drawers here for food and uh, cooking items. We also have an additional pantry right here on this side. These are all adjustable shelving. We also have a nice little fridge right here. Freezer up here. Little mini ice tray for you guys. And then we've got additional storage here. This particular unit does have the microwave. It is optional, so whether you want it or don't, you can um, choose not to. Now, the cool thing about this bed, so this client um, that we built this van for is big into the motorbike scene and having a place to store his bikes was very important and also a place to work on his bikes. And the only way to really do that is with a lift bed. So here we have the Lippert lift bed and we are the ones who happen to have this for North America and it is such a, a neat system. So a bed comes down like this and then to utilize space effectively, we've got your stairs that pull out like this to get into the bed. Now for reference, I'm 5'10". That's right at the edge with my feet. So somebody that may be six feet still has that extra room for laying on here. And anybody longer can always go diagonal. We've got a new and improved upgraded light here. No need to turn on and off. Just simply close them when it's time to go to bed. You're good to go. You also have USB and a little shelf right here for storing your iPhone or iPad. Light switch right there for turning all this on and off. As we come out, we have your AC unit here for the summer. And when you need that extra ventilation, we have a max air fan right up top there. Now this also has a diesel heater, which is adjusted right here. And this is a full four season use van. So everything in here is fully insulated. And when we talk about insulation, we're talking about wool based insulation. Uh, Havelock Wool is the company that we generally work alongside to produce a well insulated van and uh, works really great. Now let's take a look at the back. 
So as we mentioned before, the client wants to utilize this for biking. So we've got the L track built in throughout so that he can secure uh, his various bikes that he needs to. We also have a shower on the outside that can be used for cleaning yourself off or cleaning the bikes off. Now, the cool thing about this build as well, is we built a nice little custom swivel work table. So he's got access to his tools outside the van or if it's bad weather and he needs to work on it inside the van, he can do that all right here as well. Now I'm just gonna move this up and then I'll show you guys the rest of the build. So now that that's up, I can show you guys our Murphy seat here. This is designed so when you need to throw on the gear, you can, but it easily pops right back up so it's out of your way. We've also got our water fill right here. The water tank is all stored inside. Your pump and everything access is right here along with your blowout for winter. As we move to this cabinet here, we've got our EcoFlow electrical system. So this is a, a very nice system that we beta tested last summer and really enjoyed having that in one of our spec fans and are now starting to incorporate into more of our builds. We've got a little extra storage right here and uh, some along this side here. We've got the light for up top that's accessible from there. We've got the light right here for your garage space. We've got our broad arrow window set up. Go out nice and neat. You got your blinds and your bug screen and you're good to go. Windows on both sides. So we'll take a peek at the outside here. We do have another roll off bug screen right here. Comes all the way down for full coverage. The beauty of this is from the inside, you still have a window right here where you can utilize the screen or use it as blackout. That way when the bed's down, you can still keep the doors open and enjoy a nice summer view. Now, as we look on the back of this door here, we do have an aluminous box that works great for storing additional camping gear, firewood, anything like that. And also great for storing the items like the, the boots or the helmet. Up on the aluminous rack, we also have uh, rear lights for lighting everything up for either backing up or just another workspace in, in the evening. And then we also have the aluminous ladder going up to the rack. And then right here is where you would find your shore power for plugging in when you're at a campsite or when you're at home and just want to top everything up. So again, that's uh, our Robson floor plan. You can find it all at Wilderness Vans and check out a number of our other builds that are available there as well.